All righty, I have a construction update for you guys. This was filmed yesterday, January 15th, but I like to post things for the Patreons to see in a little more in depth. Um, and then I'll upload a video the next day. So I am doing daily drone updates as long as it permits my drone to fly. Um, but for my drone, it's really hard for it not to fly. It can handle a lot of winds and it can handle extreme cold. Um, and it can even handle a little bit of snow. So it'll be very rare that I don't fly. Um, so again, if something crazy is happening at Wonderland, the video will go up. I'm not going to withhold that information. But as you can see, my Buster is continuing its double down, in quotations, um, work. It is looking like it might not be that big of a retrack. So I am going to say take that with a grain of salt because it is hard to see right now with the snow, I will say. Um, but it looks like they're just doing the rails and not the wood. I haven't seen any evidence of ripping up the wood after removing the rails. But again, I don't work on these wooden coasters and uh, that could come next week. So, But as of right now, they are just lifting up the rails themselves um, and not the wood. But I would assume that woodwork should take place. Um, so we'll have to see. But speaking of woodwork, um, as you can see, metal fencing posts are arriving. And you'll see later on in the video them actually drilling holes for it. So they are moving really fast at front gate. So uh, I can tell you that I know the entire layout now. I can uh, whip it up for you guys. I'll probably do that for the podcast, whip up a drawing and show you exactly where and what things are going. Um and yeah, it's definitely really cool. Uh, I'm not sure how it's going to work yet in terms of guest flow exiting the park. I would assume that maybe the left and right side will turn into those exit points. Um, but yeah, as you can see there, steel framing has arrived for the store um, to start going up. And they are clearing out the area. And a lot of foremen are there getting ready to start a lot of work. So again, the logo is still up. And that is something I'm keeping a close eye on. Because in my opinion, the logo will tell us everything about how large of a reno this is i will say though this company needs to start work on this coaster um starting very soon so they are running out of time i would say that you know we should start seeing signs of our 2025 coaster construction by march and april the absolute latest i mean uh C cedar fair must be really pushing it with these projects uh there was some drilling going on on the road uh, behind Wild Beast. So as you can see here, they're drilling some holes right along the road edge. So I don't think it's connected to Wild Beast, but I just wanted to talk about it because I felt like it. So um, I saw them drilling holes, so I just wanted to throw in the video. Right now, it means absolutely nothing. So don't jump to any conclusions about Wild Beast. Um, it looks close to the structure, but it is a lot farther away for it to be anything important um, than you uh, realize. Um, but yeah, here's some shots. Moosehorn Falls is still continuing work with its utilities, but as you can see there, um, they are just reburying and they repaved. Um, a lot of weird activity going on with um, International Showplace and the arcade where they do Santa's picks as well, people coming in and out of them. And it's not Wonderland workers. They are, um, what do you call them? What's the word? Trades people. So trades people were going in and out of these buildings. So either they're getting renovated on the inside or again, they're getting gutted um, for what's to come in the area. So we'll definitely be keeping an eye on that. Um, but yeah, really exciting. So as you can see there, they're drilling the holes for the wood posts. So um, construction is just going to be really high pace at Wonderland for the next couple months and leading into 2025. So lots to cover. Thank you so much for watching this construction update. Again, head on over to our Patreon if you want to support the channel and get your daily dose of high quality pictures and information and monthly um, newsletters. Thanks so much, guys. Have a good one. Bye.